genius with the ball. It matters. It matters so much. Uh, there's a, uh, uh, a quote by Pep just recently uh, commented saying, my first question is always, can this player dribble? I only want players who have that skill. I want fullbacks, center backs, midfielders, forwards who can dribble. You can learn control and passing easily. So dribbling is key. That's an important statement. And he's a, he's coaches in the premier league. So parents, you parents, everyone's looking like I'm all snacks. I need to be seen. I need to be seen. no, of course you need to be seen. You know how you you know how you, you can be seen? Be good. There's YouTube. Just be good. Learn how to manipulate the ball. Never lose that ball. And have the freedom to be able to do those things. Luis Daba did those things. That's why he's listed as a top coach. That is what is listed. All right. So I, I have a solution for the madness of MLS Next. I have it. Dear Arizona Youth Soccer Association, or Arizona Soccer Association, ASA, please listen to the words that are coming out of my mouth right now. Do we have any, like, subtle music? We don't. Do we have any music? I'll look for it. Oh, we have, we have music. ASA, there you go. listen. We do la obligata in the house. That is not good music. Well, anyway, I was just kidding. How are you? Anyways, yeah, turn that off. Um, this is what you do. All you have to do, just do an experiment. One age group, ASA, host at centrally located Phoenix College. Host at Phoenix College, rent our facility, and just do one age group. And, and have it be free. Have it be the official ODP that you'll actually go play games. You train it at Phoenix. It has to be free. Find coaches. I'll coach it. I'll, I'll give my time for free to see uh, to allow these kids to have the opportunity to actually be seen locally. It has to be centrally located. Blow it up somehow and say this is and do it where you're gonna they're gonna be showcase and participate in big events or whatever you have to do. But it has to be the best players. It can't be three three clubs dictating these things or four clubs or however big this MLS next. BS gets one team, one team, the best players and get coaches that are not affiliated with club soccer. Like they have to, they have to beat the end quota and they have to win so they can get other players in their second, third, fourth division or whatever acronym they're creating for those, uh, those losers. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, not losers. Those wannabes uh, do something different. Okay. One team, one, the best players, the best players, has to be the best. Can't be some. They all must be technical. We have that. We have it. It, just, it can't. We don't have enough to split into three teams? All East Valley? Hey, do you want to just steal Jets, Mike? Why? I don't know. Just yours... turn it off. Is my mic that bad? I don't know how it's going to sound in the end, but it keeps on... Flipping, so I I sound fantastic. How, how do I sound, Jack? It sounds good to me. I sound great. It's your headset. You sound, we'll you sound great. You're Thank turning you. red you. on the roadcaster. All right, but you're well, right. It's my headset. Oh shoot! Oh no, we're good. We're good. Right Anyways, now. what? Just do one team. ASA, you can afford that instead of buying another administrator. Because when I when I was growing up, ASA, we had one one administrator being paid. Leslie, she. We get, you need need her. You need, you need someone that actually deals with all the paperwork and stuff. But now, how many have now? Seven, eight? How many people are on the payroll? Okay, so when you guys get a ton of money again, and instead of hiring another administrator, just do a ODP team. Okay? One age group that is centrally located and gives a, a real tryout That's not that doesn't have club dictating things. The pay to play bull crap. We need it to be, we need to do one team just to prove it. Because if we got the right players, like the 06s did, and they were the number one team in the country, oh, I get God Soccer, whatever. They were flipping good, playing against top teams in the world in Florida, 170,000 people watching them play. And what do we do? We destroy it. 
We destroyed it. 09s, number one team in the country. They won state. They're going to regionals. Team's destroyed. That's what we do. We destroy things. So ASA, get involved. Do something. We have to do something different. We, we keep doing the same thing over and over and over again. It's so frustrating. It's it's so stupid. Um, God, there's so much hate with my podcast, and and I apologize for that. I just find it silly. Now, I I, I may be wrong. I, no, let me take that back. I'm always wrong. Agreed. Everyone's wrong. We're all in the pursuit of trying to find the truth, which may never be found. So. Let's change our approach. Because MLS Next isn't a change of the approach. It's just a different name. It's a DA. It's a better name. Same people running the show. We are not and all these clubs are, all they do is identify talent. They're they're just trying to bring in the best players. That's it. They're recruiters. Okay. Central centralize the recruiting. Just do one age group. Do one test. See what happens. Do something different. Right, Jack? Yes. I'm sorry, guys. I, I didn't get you too involved in this podcast, but thanks for being on. That's all I got. You got I you, thought Jack had some great insight. He does. Yes. Yes. Deadpool. Oh, wait. Deadpool has something. What's up? You're going to talk about money, huh? Uh-huh. That's what we got to talk about. And also, Jack, what were you trying to say to me just two minutes ago? What were you trying to say? I wasn't trying to say anything. Are you guys like doing back end no, conversation? No, 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 Stop. He's like, oh, it feels he's like great. yeeting his head to the left. I like wasn't hard. even cracking my and neck. I was, and I was whispering to stop because it's going to mess him up. <laughs> or you can pop my toes. I can pop my fingers if I want. Okay. Are, my are, head. are we going to talk money? Yeah. All right. So how much do you want? So after the video, you have to pay me seven. It's been in seven So wait, days. seven what? Seven dollars. Oh, okay. Seven dollars. So a dollar an episode? Yeah, but okay. you missed seven episodes. And seven payments. To, yeah. So what about interest, Jet? What does he owe you for Easy. being late? If he, if he gets late, he has to double the money. Sorry. Oh, double oh. the money. Double the money. So what do you think? Should uh, Deadpool get paid? El Rojo doesn't get paid. Why is that? N- no sucks. one should get paid. Yeah, communism. Well, thank you for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed the show. If you want more, I have daily podcast Monday through Friday with more advice on youth soccer development for parents and coaches. You can find us on iHeartRadio, Google Play, iTunes, or anywhere else podcasts are found. Or go to CoachCameron.com for direct access to this content, which I haven't updated that webpage in a while. See you next Sunday, 7 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Yes. <laughs> All right. Jets, Jets out. Ugh. If you enjoyed that clip, you can enjoy all the clips at youtube.com forward slash Coach Cameron Soccer to get all my content. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know what's going on and when we appear online, which is typically every Sunday, 7 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Hope to see you this Sunday for our next live show.